Well, good news, I'm not going to prison. Hey guys, how you doing today? It is Wednesday and I have a lot of things I gotta get done. Uh, I have to make a list of things I have to do today. Ooh. So I guess I'll go to the post office first, then dry cleaners, uh, and then uh, I'm going to fight that ticket that uh, Ben got when he was driving the car and it didn't have the license plate sticker on it. So I'm going to fight that. Uh, a friend of mine said exact same thing happened to her. She fought it and they just, as long as she had the sticker on there, they kind of... Uh, wiped the ticket clean. It's $110, so it's worth fighting. I'm not sure if you guys know this, but uh, we were mortgage-free as of May. Uh, but one of the things we neglected to remember is that the bank was using our money or our, the money that we were putting into our mortgage every month also included our taxes. So you have to pay uh, pay property taxes on your property every single year and we were doing it through our mortgage but since our mortgage is paid off the bank stopped paying our taxes and now we got a letter uh saying that oh, we have a fine of 4438 for not paying our taxes so i have to go to the town office and pay our taxes and uh, we'll be all set. And then I'll have to set up type, some type of a schedule with them from now on. Uh, then I'm going down to uh, see uh, Candace and James's book release, uh, the Edgy Veg Carnivore book, whatever the cooking book, the vegetarian cookbook. So they're launching their book tonight at the YouTube space and I have to go do that. Just before I get there though, I'm gonna go and do the food review for Friday, uh, which is the Hot Star cheese stuffed chicken, deep fried chicken. Uh, and then, uh, yeah, that, that's gonna be my day. So hang on to your britches, people. It's gonna be a busy one. Made it to Lafroy, gotta check that post office box, see if VAT19 sent me my stuff. Can't wait to do it, actually. It's gonna be painful, but fun. Yes. See you again. All right. We got it. Vat 19, people. World's hottest chocolate bar in my grasp. Nice. Next stop, Alcona. made it to Alcona dry cleaning uh, the lot the dry cleaning is in the trunk I'll be right back hang on pizza would be nice but I have to eat other things and I just discover that this shirt unfortunately has to be retired one of my Hawaiian shirts this is uh, again one of my father's shirts and uh, it's just worn through and it's got a rip now which kind of sucks I liked this shirt. I have to try and find a replacement somehow. All right. Oh yeah, let's go to Hawaii. It's time to get out of here. Next stop, town offices to pay the taxes. Tax time. <laughs> time to pay the property taxes so I don't go to prison. And my lights are on. Check your lights off, dude. Oh, keys. Let's go. Oh, it's a long walk. Long walk over there in the rain. Well, good news. I'm not going to prison. Uh, she laughed. Uh, so I'm like, oh, can we hook this up to my visa? Because I get points on my visa and I'd rather my taxes come out on my visa. But they charge because they use a third person, third party service. They charge 1.75% on the amount owing. So if your taxes are $2,000, you'd have to calculate that at 
1.75% and they charge you that on your visa on top of your taxes. So, or you can just hook it up to your debit, which is what I'm gonna do. Unfortunately, I don't get the points on my debit. Uh, oh well, so I'll have to set it up to uh, pre-authorized payments and then I won't have to worry about it again. Cool. Next stop, the courthouse which is back south, which is the, the direction I need to go. So everything's working out nice and smoothly. I've got to put my seatbelt on. I'm gonna get another notice of infraction. Another ticket. That would suck. All right, off to Churchill. Well, I read a little bit more on this notice of offense and uh, it says uh, Monday, Tuesday or Wednesday, subject to av availability 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. They only give you one hour to come in or you can telephone. So uh, I guess I'll telephone because it is deserted here. Uh, so that was a little bit, not really too much of a waste of time, but all right, next, ah, next stop. Ah! That's next stop, Bradford. So the gas price here is a dollar. Sorry about the shaking, guys. The gas price here is a dollar seven point six. We'll see what it is tonight. I've got enough gas to do all the things I need to do and get back here tonight. So we'll see if it drops, and I guarantee you it will drop at least two cents. See if I'm right. See if I'm wrong. So one oh seven point six. I am just at Finch and Young Street, the north end of Toronto, or Toronto. And I believe it's just south of Finch. And this is the Finch subway station that Paul and I catch when we go downtown to go see a game. So that's right there. And uh, I gotta keep my eyes open. It wasn't on, it's so new that it wasn't on Street View. So when I went to look for it on Street View at home, on the computer, it didn't show me exactly where it was. So I gotta just kinda keep my eyes peeled, keep looking for it, and uh, don't get into an accident. All right, so let's get there, get our food review done, and then head down to YouTube space. <music> It's right there, it's a very small location. And uh, this is probably like the wrong time of day to be doing this because there's nowhere to park. So I'm gonna have to turn my car around because this side, I'm like right beside a fire hydrant. Don't want a hot fire hydrant ticket for sure. And so we're gonna have to make a U-turn and uh, park maybe right over there, that guy's leaving. Let's go. I got a great spot right in front of Hotstar. And then when I read the sign, it said no parking and no stopping between four and 6 p.m. So uh, I had to find this little side street and it's just like no parking anywhere. And it's locked out. And I think it's that way or that way because I like went down a road, came out back out onto the main road and had to go past it again and then turn and then go down another street. So uh, I'm just gonna clean the car up a little bit, but luckily I found a spot is what I'm saying. Uh, I'm gonna clean the car up a little bit and then uh, we will see if how much it's cost to park here. Probably not much. And uh, oh, I've got the parking pass thing. And uh, let's go get some food. Try the hot cheese fried chicken. Yep. All right. Ooh, I didn't know you had spicy. <laughs> yeah, it's spicy. Well, let's do spicy. Let's go medium. Yes, please. Woo! I forgot what to say. What a 
dink. What a dink. Check that out, people. I want to get really, I want to get this right, right, right there. I want it to be like right. I know this is from Taiwan, but it looks like Australia, don't it? Oh man, I want to cut it. They, they, they don't cut anything in there. They said they want to keep the juiciness in there. I think I made a huge mistake in only getting like three napkins. Mm. Ah! 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 Mm, it's hot. Holy crap. Oh, it's oozing. Hello, vlog people. We are back. And uh, I found a good parking spot, like I said. And I uh, just finished the meal. I wasn't going to eat the whole thing, but uh, apparently there's a bone in, in one part of it. And uh, so it looks like it looks like it's going to be one huge solid piece of chicken, but it's not. There's a, there's bone in it. So I hope this guy doesn't park right at my ass because I won't be able to get out because there's a another car right in front of me. I parked a bit maybe too close to him, but he can get out. There's a driveway in front of him. And... Uh, but it was probably a bad idea. I should start to try and move my car now. Okay, we're gonna get downtown. So hang on to your britches once again. Well, it's 5.46. Made it to YouTube space in the best parking spot I've ever got. YouTube space parking spot. So, let's go in. I thought I'd come out here real quick before I go back in and, and hopefully get a interview with Candace but uh, like right now they're playing copyrighted music probably in there so I thought I'd just quickly come out here but they've done this whole layout really really nice they got a little free bar with wine and champagne they've got our books all over the place they've got a big wall so you can take a picture I guess with your friends or with uh, Candace and James beside her big poster there. So congratulations, Candace and James. You guys worked really hard. I'm so glad I met you guys a year and a half ago. Worked with you a bunch of times. Unfortunately, didn't work on my channel, but maybe sometime in the very near future, we could do something cool on the vlog channel because the vlog people seem to not mind. And uh, maybe we'll just kind of change it up and I just won't like videotape you doing a cooking show. I'll just be a part of it. What do you think about that? So let's go inside, look at some more stuff. Hopefully we'll get a quick interview with Candace and James and then we'll head home. So this is the journey of me making food for James and James improving it. Yeah, I would modify that a little bit and just say, um, for me to sort of step into this world of eating more plant-based, um, I needed something that was a little bit more accessible um, than the stuff that I had known was vegan. Yeah, so it's out next week, and so now we just want to enjoy and drink with all of you and celebrate all of our hard work, and uh, please eat the food. The food is all from the cookbook. Have a couple drinks, and uh, thank you so much for being here. Good job. I like this. Congratulations. That was so awesome. Congratulations, thank sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for being here. So really awesome. appreciate it. guys so that's my vlog for today Candace and James were like super crazy busy the whole time so got time to a kind of a small little interview with them and congratulated them I'm very happy for them
Like I said, the uh, gas price dropped six cents from a dollar six point something to a dollar one point six. And of course, I parked on the wrong side of the pump. Lots of people here.